Hello everyone, Stevie here. It is chilled Sunday. We're going to bring it down a bit. We're going to play a couple of games. What I'm going to do today is I'm going to speak for a little bit. We're going to lament over, well, I'm going to lament over what's happened in my week in Dokkan with the Daily Dokkan series. We'll talk about a few of the good cards I've got. We'll talk about the event and then I'm going to play one or two bosses. We'll see how long they are because I don't want this, I don't want this video to go too long. It's Sunday. We've all got stuff to do. I'm currently waiting for Dragon Ball Super 49, the subbed a version of it to come online, so I'm... Um, coincidentally, we got the Hope Fight Against Despair event, which is essentially the future Trunks timeline story, which which is amazing, which blew my mind. I didn't realise what the event was to start with. I was like, another, I was like, oh, this is a nice long story event. I like this. This is cool. We're getting more stuff to do in Dokkan. Thumbs up. And then as I got into it, I was like, whoa, I'm playing the alternate timeline, this is really cool. And then, I mean, obviously with the alternate timeline came more character cards. One of the character cards which I managed to obtain is the SSR Gohan future. Now, the funny bit is, I pulled this, um, we've got this card, there's two different versions of it. This is the version that you get from the event, so it's an alright card. It could be better, it could be worse, but you can farm him. As you can see, his super at the moment's at 4. I'm going to try and get that up to 10 while that event's here. But, at the same time, this card came out. And I got this one in a summon pool. I did not realise how good a card this was at first. I was like, yeah, it's an SSR. So at that, I was happy. And then I realised after that it's one of the main cards in this week's banner summon. So I was quite happy with that. Tech type plus 50%, that's always good. Attack plus 60 when HP is 8 or below. Only problem I have with this card is Cannon. Now, I'm going to talk about Cannon in another video, maybe on another channel, because Cannon is a whole crazy thing, but if we're talking Cannon, should he not have only one arm? I thought Gohan in the future timeline only had one arm. Is that just me? Or am I remembering it? Is this maybe a different timeline? I remember seeing something vividly where Gohan has one arm. And they also make a joke about it in Rebridged constantly. So, yeah. Why is he, on, why, why is he got two arms? I don't understand that. Bandai, what's happening? I guess we'll never know. But I mean, yeah, I got... Oh, go away, Sam, man. I also got this Beerus card. Now, I got this on a spawn this week. I was happy. I've been wanting to be this card for a long time. I wasn't overjoyed because I was like, nah, it's the tech type, it's an SR, but it's Beerus, so yeah. I was like, it's Beerus. Yes! I love Beerus. Beerus is great. He's such a good character. Mainly because he's the god of destruction, and if we mess with him, he will kill us all. But other than that, he's a really good character, but then... This happened. Kamehameha out came Beerus. I actually could not believe it. Not just Beerus, but it is the Irreversible Judgment Beerus. In a coming update, there is... Basically, this card is going to ha has a Fury mode in it. I don't think it works yet. I don't think it can be, do can be Dokkan'd up to that stage. Or I don't know the technical stuff for that because I don't play the Japanese version and I don't watch that much Japanese stuff either. The, the only Japanese stuff I watch is like Final Flash Vegeta, a few other YouTubers that are cool and shouts out to them as well because obviously this is talking about the week. Earlier on in the week I was ready to quit doing Dokkan videos, like flat out quit because it is so hard to engage with the community video wise due to issues. Now I may I'm going to talk about the issues in a video later on today. I'm going to be doing another video because it's Sunday and it's chill time and I'm going to be, I used to do podcasts all the time so what I'm going to do is rather than do a podcast I'm just going to talk about the week, talk about things that's happened and I'm going to set it to some Dragon Ball Z gaming, do a bit of speaking and we're going to talk over that and I will let you know why it is so hard to get things like this promoted to people that play Dokkan so that'll be covered, check out the channel later on today. I've got no idea what I'm going to call it. Sunday Boom? I don't know. I've got no idea what I'm going to call it. But I'm going to upload it to my YouTube channel and I'm going to upload it to my podcast channel which also syndicates to iTunes and all that other sort of stuff so you'll be able to listen to it 
on the go in your ears. I think I am an idiot. I do not understand how it has took me so long to get my Goku up to even this point. Is it just me that has had trouble getting the Goku medals for awakening this character? Like, it dro it was driving me insane. It's like, my friend Willie, he comes around, he also plays it. Then Ransack, if you ever see him, friend him. But yeah, and he was there. He's like, yeah, I got it straight away. This, this was driving me insane. I could I, I grinded for days, the, the same levels, for days and days. And Finally, Jackie Chun dropped the medals and I got the awakening done. And it was great, but now I've got to get more medals and I've got to awaken this one because I cannot be the only person that's not got this one as a ultra rare. It's not happening. Not on my watch. So that's been the roundup of the week. It's been a really good week, of course. This was the week we moved on to... Uh, I used to call it the B team because it was my B team. The game, like, quest-wise, very little's been done. The rank's only 55. But this is no longer the B team. This is the team B. This is this team is probably now stronger than the team that I was playing before, which is now on my phone. And um, not only that, but a lot of the quests are still to be done. There's still a ton of dragon stones in this game, so I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I mean, Final Flash Vegeta gives away a lot of accounts. I don't want to give this account away. I really like this account, but it's something that may have happened in the future one day. Depends how good my other game gets. I might give this one away. But without further ado, let us get to today's fights. Now, I'm not going to bother with the levels. I'm just going to go straight to the fights. I'm basically going to carry on what we've been doing for the last few days. So we're going to do the next level of Fight Against Despair. The level is called Last Hope. Now, it is a physical slash int type enemy we are going to be facing. But we'll just jump right in. And we'll do it on Z-Hard because why not? I am just going to take you straight to the bosses of this level, which I believe are Android 17 and 18. No. Here we go. Boss time. Time to fight. Fight, fight, fight. So we are against Android 17 and 18. One is a physical type. One is an int type. So what we're going to do here, I want Kabito Kai to hit all them away. So we're going to at least see one special here. Kabito Kai is going to hit his special Neo Crush Hand Cannon, whatever it's called. It really glitches out on this one. I don't know if I pressed the round half speed. 22,000 damage done. There we go. Yeah, I was on half speed. Nappa done some damage. We didn't really ever go sadistic 18. Oh, 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 what is happening? Okay, that's a new one on me. I've never seen that one before. And he's done, this is, oh, what the hell? I thought I had this card and I thought I had a different finish. And I forgot to take Dandies with me. Uh, so at least we've got Freezer with us. So that is uh, final form, full power Freezer. It's Berserker. That's his character. I think what I'm going to try and do here is I'm going to try and bring these down so we can at least get Majub his finish on 17. And this this should take 17 out. There's no way he's, take, he's taking this hit. Here we go. Broly's da. Broly's da takes a slap. Broly's da takes another slap. Come on, noob. Come on, Majub. Come on. Majin Beam. 13,000. He's still up. He's still up. So he's... He's wanting to attack Beerus, it seems. That is a... Strange decision for him. I'm going to put Kabito Kai there. Beerus, it really doesn't matter what Beerus hits here. He is going to kill that android. Kabito Kai, hit them. Let's see. Beerus should kill the first one. Oh, crap. I hate, it. I hate Beerus when he looks like he's in pain. I don't like seeing Beerus in pain. It's not nice. She's waiting. Just please, Kabito Kai. Nice one. Nice one. The blocking did well there. So, Cargo, it's time to roll him out. The only cards here are really going to do much damage are Frieza and Broly's father. So, this should just be a attrition round. Hopefully, we don't die. There we go. 
the main hope for us is that she doesn't hit her finish and we're past that stage already so let's see how it's set up now make or break time I think make or break time what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna juggle these about I'm gonna put Beerus there no crap no I'm gonna put Beerus there I'm gonna put Beerus there I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the risk I'm gonna try and get reds down and I'm gonna try and get Beerus as super oh has it worked please please work oh I just missed it gosh darn it Poor, poor noob. Poor, poor, poor Maju noob. Ma Maju. Oh man. So sh Beerus nearly destroyed her. Let's finish this android woman off because she's annoying me and I want my reward. She's not hitting us till last. So I would say he's, she's dead. I don't think she's going to get past these three attacks. Boom! Kibito Kai, one hit. Boom! KO! There we go. Z hard, done. If you want to do the level, watch this back, look at some of the techniques. Remember, you're going up against a physical and an int type, so you want a lot of reds, a lot of oranges. Oh, as, as always, if you can get a Super Saiyan Bardock in your team, or as your friend even, if you can get a friend with a Super Saiyan Bardock for this level, I think it'd be the best. That'd be the ultimate way to beat it. I got a Roshi and a Trunks. Again. It's been a nice chilled week. This is the end of Chilled Sunday. Hit subscribe if you like what you see. Later on today I'll have another more talk. You're not going to see me on camera, so that's a bonus. It's just going to be me chatting about the week, chatting about what's happening. I've got, not got a name for it yet. I'll have a name for it by then. This will be up after I have watched Dragon Ball Super. I'm Stevie. I'll catch you all in a bit. Take it easy.